many chess players have experienced the disappointment of a KH-47 M2 Kinzel nuclear-capable air-launched anti-ship ballistic missile launched from a McCoy and Gorovich MiG-31 BM supersonic interceptor aircraft wiping out their pieces within a few moves. And it is the result of a common misconception about material versus activity that is easily avoided. Hello guys. Welcome back to another chess tutorial. Yes, it is me, Grandmaster Vikram Rahul Abhishek Pranav Rajesh. Today I will show you how to avoid this opening mistake and destroy your opponent with this simple yet crushing counter gambit. It is a variation of the Queen's Gambit declined opening, and it offers a modern continuation to the Albion counter gambit. Let's look back at the board moments before impact. We can see that white opened with d4, and black responded with d5, a standard opening. However, after white played c4, the queen's gambit, black decided to accept the sacrifice. This was a fatal mistake, as now black has displaced a central pawn, allowing white rapid development of their pieces as well as the necessary infrastructure to maintain and operate interceptor aircraft carrying anti-ship armament. After succumbing to capitalistic sentiments of material greed, Black has sacrificed activity and severely crippled himself in terms of counterplay, and there is nothing they can do except helplessly move their pieces until they are inevitably massacred by a nuclear warhead. We can avoid nuclear hollow caused by simply declining to capture White's C4 pawn, transposing to the Queen's Gambit declined and significantly increasing our options for defense and counterattack. We will play e5, the Albin counter gambit. After white captures, we will advance the d-pawn to d4. White plays e3 in an attempt to undouble his pawns. This is a careless move, as it allows bishop to b4 check. White blocks with the bishop. Pawn captures on e3. It appears that we have hung our bishop, so white captures. This will be white's final blunder, as they have now entered the Lasker trap. Pawn captures on f2 with check. White cannot capture the pawn without hanging their queen and is forced to play king e2, allowing our pawn to reach the 8th rank. We will now under promo to a knight so that check is delivered, denying any chance of defense. Rook captures on g1 is not possible as this would allow bishop to g4, skewering the king and queen. White once again must move the king. We continue the attack with queen 2 h4 check again forcing white to move the king as g3 would result in queen 2 e4 check, forking the king and rook. After knight c6, white can only play useless moves in an attempt to prolong the game. Bishop c3, bishop g4, and queen e1. We can now castle queen side with check, and white is completely lost. The rook, queen, bishop, and both knights are now in position to attack the white king, the next move is obvious. We know that chess is a political landmine of illegal moves. For example, launching an RS-28 Samak liquid propellant multiple independently targetable re-entry vehicle equipped super heavy intercontinental ballistic missile is not possible due to the position of our knight on the 8th rank. The International Chess Federation dictates that a piece cannot be moved to a square that is already occupied by a piece of the same color. The spread of the multiple warheads carried by the MIRV equipped RS-28 Samut would cover the square that our knight already occupies, making this an illegal move that would result in the arbiter founding an international coalition to impose economic sanctions against black. This crippling attack on black's economy would give white ample opportunity to take advantage of the weakened industrial capacity caused by your blunder. Instead, we must maneuver with surgical precision to continue towards checkmate. I will now give you 2 seconds to find the best move. Congratulations to those who found the best continuation. Indeed, in this position, the most effective way to win the game is to employ the stealth, mobility, nuclear deterrence, and first strike capabilities of ballistic missile submarines such as an Ohio-class nuclear-powered submarine armed with UGM-1338 Trident II submarine-launched ballistic missiles. With mobility and concealment in Black's arsenal, Black can now take full advantage of their material and development to punish White's vulnerable position. 
now pay close attention as we effectively exploit our strategic advantages to force checkmate. Thank you to Skillshare for sponsoring this video. Skillshare offers thousands of inspiring classes for creative and curious people on topics like graphics design, photography, productivity, and more. Explore new skills, deepen existing passions, and get lost in creativity. I've actually just recently taken Productivity Masterclass, The Principles of Productivity by Ali Abdal through Skillshare. The videos are well thought out and have high production value, and the class is structured into short videos that fit into my busy schedule. Classes involve actively engaging projects and are taught by experienced teachers who pique your interest in any subject, whether it's web development, fine arts, or even freelance entrepreneurship. Skillshare is curated specifically for learning, meaning there are no ads so you can stay focused, and new classes are always being launched, allowing you to follow wherever your creativity takes you. Whether you're a dabbler or a pro, a hobbyist or a master, you're creative. Discover what you can make with classes for every skill level on Skillshare.